I could frame I any one it. of you in a dark corner. I did it. And capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh. He I actually said this. I believe taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb I'm word back. for a wonderful photographic trick. Right to the beginning of the game. Insane week. And nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe know, ever the again. The portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images what? for self-expression. Wait, what do I do? Sorry, I couldn't resist. Okay, I can't go out into the, the hallway. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Not I'm capturing. Not into capturing your interest. That's kind of sick, isn't it? <laughs> I guess somebody hasn't had their coffee. Do you want to try again? Okay, okay, the Daguerrean process. Blah, blah, blah. Victoria, if only you knew, you wouldn't be giving Let's, me that stank uh, face right now. Let's move on. <laughs> uh, anyway, so the Daguerrean process made portraiture quite popular mainly because it gave the subjects clear, defined features. You can learn more when you finish reading the assigned chapters. And hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo when the Everyday time Heroes to change time. The winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First, artwork. let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. Melissa, <laughs> get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. David? David. Da David. All I need is David's number, and Jefferson is one text closer to life without parole. My bag. I should be able to track down David's number from the school pamphlet. Found you. 5556. Five, five, Five hundred fifty-five, six hundred thirty-eight, two forty-three. Six hundred thirty-eight, two forty-three. Okay. Um. Do, 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 do. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else. Please. And take Jefferson down fast. Oh. Max? You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. The past within the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? Am I gonna die? I don't wanna die. It doesn't matter what happens to me. I have to save Chloe. Yeah, but we can't go out. Oh, Rachel, I'm sorry. Damn. So we could have never saved her. I'm happy to fix it, so you'll be here to get your fancy camera, Victoria. Victoria, it's nice to know how you really feel. <sighs> Kate, Kate. Hi, Kate. Oh, hey, Max. Kate, listen to me. I am. Always remember that you're not alone. I've got your back no matter what happens. So do a lot of other people. We all care. We're all here for you. You need to know that. Max, that makes me feel so blessed for the first time this week. I I don't know what to say. That's okay. Neither do I. Maybe we could both use a hug. Thanks. You always know the right thing to do. <sighs> okay. You know what? Take a photo of Kate. Smile. That's a lovely picture. I love seeing Kate smile. It's a dumb paper ball. This is the last time somebody bullies you, Kate. 
Man, if only I could pick it up and throw it away. Can't go out there. Can't go out there. There's still some beauty left in Arcadia Bay. I still feel like the lighthouse is calling out to me. Camera. I'd like to bust this up right now. Victoria, I'm sorry I can't even to talk stand to next to that damn. psycho. I can't even talk to Victoria. You know what? Here. Here's your photo that you've been looking for the whole game. I see right through your bullshit, Jefferson. Everybody else will too. Here's this photo that you've been looking for this entire Mr. game. Mr. Jefferson? Here. We need to talk. Uh, Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? Yes, I see. But maybe you shouldn't. Uh, and why not? Hold on, Victoria. Are you okay, Max? I will be when Victoria understands that hiding behind a screen, posting videos of people is incredibly cruel and unfair. You're smart enough to know how easy it is to hurt somebody, to destroy their life. I just want you to think about how much it would hurt if somebody did that to you. You can always make the right choice, Victoria. I know you've got a good heart. I've seen it. Listen, I... I didn't... You don't have to explain. There's no reason for you to be so insecure that you can't be happy with your own talent. Wouldn't it be better to lift people up than to bring them down? You could inspire people. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about now, do I, Mr. Jefferson? I think I should stay out of this one, Victoria. Then I guess I'm done talking. And that's okay, too. That was kind of random, Max. What did you mean? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh... That was easy. No. It wasn't easy at Not all. all. Well, I, uh... You pleb. I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell, the, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. To be... innocent. Or guilty. Uh... Thanks for the photo, and maybe both of us will be jet-setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. 